Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to part 24 of Let's Play Europa of Assault War, Third Odyssey for Vinland, where we are currently at war with the English. And we don't know how this war, I don't honestly don't know how this war is going to go. They are currently at war with the French too. Um, so, yeah. Don't know how this is going to go. Um, for some reason, they have no strategic interest in, you know, you know using our stuff. So there's 14,000 uh, English there. So that's a large chunk of their army. Good, good, good. Now, maybe they're there. Uh, so yeah, when it comes to the piece that I want, I'm not looking for anything too major. Because, you know, I'm not greedy. But like... Just Scotland. I, I think I would I would happily take that and one, two, three, four, five, six. I think that would be what we would take. It would give me the rest of Scotland, and it would also well actually no, I'd probably take that. Ah uh, no, that one's a little bit more questionable. But it would give me the fort, and the fort is you know a lot more important to me. Oh, fuck yeah, I took the colonists from there, didn't I? Shit, shit, shit. Um, I call you. Send you there. One, two. It's okay, that will take us back up to five for now. So you're upset, you're not, because you have an army on, so we'll do you first then. Best way to look at it is if there's an army there, we'll do that one last. Stay there, because we're using you, aren't we? I forget. We siege this up, and then we'll... Uh... Okay, there we go. Beautiful. So we've got one free versus that five one. So in fire, they're going to be a lot better than us. So this could be a massacre on their part. They could destroy us. I, I will take the victory. I'll take the W. Ah, Connox is also a port. Uh, a, f a fort, not a port. It's also a port, but I meant a fort. I think they're going to Desmond, so we're going to go run around and try and catch them there. Oh, no, 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 no. No, they're... Um... That's fine. You, you, you cause problems there where you want. Okay, good, 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 good. My vassal was just doing exactly what I was doing. I was like, no, 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 no. English army ain't fucking going across here. Get fucked. Okay. So we only need 46. That's, that's, I mean, it's a lot, but it's less than I was expecting. Also, Ireland is just fucking full of forts. Like, the actual fuck Ireland. Seriously, let's, so let's have a look at this. Um, how are we looking in terms of economies? Elysia is... What the fuck? How is Elysia just suddenly caught up with me? Oh, that's some bullshit. Elysia's like, yeah, bro. Back at it again. Jesus Christ. They've not even got... Well, I guess they have the, uh, the advantage of being states everywhere, whereas we are... Very unstated right now. And you know what? Do you know fucking what? I'm going to do the dumb thing of uh, funneling a bunch of state money into states right now. Well, not money, but a bunch of points into states. Because I don't like the idea of them beating me. Motherfucker colony. Okay, I need another colonist. Um, you are actually the more important of the two colonists. I'll recall from you. You know what? Let's start working back here again. Okay, so we've fully stated all that up. Look at you. 
Okay, so the British are really weak right now. The French, for some reason, don't want to use uh, cross uh, cross the border with us. Um, that's what it is. So how many... Uh, well, like, what include... What? Okay, so the Isle of Man is not included. It's, it, Isle of Man was included in Scotland. So we do need three more provinces here. Uh, I'd I'm going to give these straight to Ulster. Though I feel like instead of that, I should take that. Because it's, again, it's forts. Forts are going to be the best friend for us. That you know, make our life a lot easier. So we're going to focus on the forts of Scot uh, of uh, Ireland. Now, don't get me wrong. If I t I could take York, and you know, if I could, if I was willing to piss off Europe as a whole, I would. But I'm not. Like I'm, I am not willing to piss off Europe to that degree. Because we still, we've still got loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of time. Like, let's not risk our entire life on something small, you know? I mean, technically, this would be a, this is a big win for us, but you get my point. Let's not waste our time. Ah, so Alicia is for some reason involved in the French war. I don't know why though, because the they're not allied with the Elysians. So and France and both. Oh wait, no, I don't know how they got in that war at all. It would make sense if they were helping the British, but they're not, and I don't understand. Okay, whatever, not my problem. Oh right, you're in the wrong. No, no, you're in the right naval region. Stay there. Yeah, once we've got Ireland sieged up, we'll worry about the UK. Sorry, not the UK. Sorry, England. We are already in the UK. I go with me. You fucking embargoing me, you little prick. Alright. Fine. Take my embargo, you little lang asshole. Alright, we'll get the last uh, Irish province done. Oh yeah, those trade ships. We don't need them, so let's just... Uh... Let's get that done. We've got our five colonies. I'm happy. Ah, uh, yeah. Also, if you wouldn't mind just going to siege there, that'd be beautiful. Who am I kidding? Doing as I ask you would be uh, would be far too useful. I'm gonna slowly throw this army from uh, fort to fort while we uh, siege over in um, over in Ireland. France is absolutely wrecking in their war. I'd love money from this too, but... We'll see. Wow, Ireland uh, just got absolutely decked on. Well, Ireland is... Um... I mean, if I could take more, I would. That's a lie. I would not take any more of Ireland just yet. My goal would be to take probably like London, just as like, just for the memes, I would probably try to take London. I know for a fact it would be a dumb idea because oh wow, France would want to call like yeah, France at the moment like if we took land that isn't too near to France, they wouldn't be upset with me. Like I'm contemplating that because it's another fort, it's closer to you know, it's another fort that I don't have to conquer like call like you know, it's another fort I don't have to siege next time. Nope, naval supplies are too useful. We make a lot of money from naval supplies, so let's uh, not mess about. See what I mean? Naval supply... I've never liked naval supplies until playing as Vinland. Playing as Vinland, you get like a new appreciation for them. I'm surprised the English haven't just given up. I've taken Lofane. We've we've won every battle. They're currently in a war against France as well. A war in which France, for some reason, doesn't want to take any of my stuff. Uh, this guy's 48, so we'll keep the current guy. Uh, ah, yes, we'll think, yeah, we'll definitely make sure we get uh, the old, the new world, uh, so the old world uh, converted first. Oh, no, no, we don't want to go by ship. That would leave us vulnerable. I'd rather get this fort first.
Could release whales. You know, could release stuff like that. That would be uh, a lot harder to get, but... We'll go until this war makes no more sense. I.e. probably when the uh, French decide they don't want to be in the war anymore. And by that, I mean a war. They don't want to be at war anymore. Uh, oh, yeah, definitely siege ability right now. I think there's just two more... Yeah, there's just two forts left after we take uh, your, uh, that... So yeah, once we take uh, these last two forts, we've won. Yeah, we take London. That's going to be such a big, like, kick in the dick. They do have some local defensiveness there, but... I want to watch both forts just fall and the English army just scurry. For now, let's make sure we're not um, selecting any of this. Because we, we want to know what the piece is like before we do that. Uh, I don't really want corruption right now, so we'll take the corruption. And the English walked past me. That's completely and utterly fine because they're still going to have to seize those forts. For the, it, it, it's, it's a fucking win. I, I really don't care if they, they try and siege that. It's fine. I'm seizing the capital, you know. This is a win no matter, for me, no matter how they, you look at it. They could they could unseige this, and that would still only put me like a, a disadvantage of one fort to their every fort that I've took from them so far. So really, it's a win no matter how you look at it. I really want to like force Ireland from them as well, just. At the very least, I would like the one, like, I'd like Formund and the Wales out. Just because that's two big areas that they would no longer have access to. And that would make me very happy. Okay, so these two f uh, should be finishing pretty shortly. Come on. They're probably going to take that back before we get these two, just because I know how the AI works. We're sieging at 34 days. They're sieging at 38. Oh, wow. We have more defensiveness than the English. That I didn't think would be possible. Well, I, no, not possible. I didn't think would happen more accurately. Varengas Voda. As our colonists head south, they come closer and closer with the lost Greek folk and their ways. Due to their influence, they start gaining a strange accent and start dressing in effeminate clothing. I'm Rangain now shall become Varangains in the Elysian region. And we haven't got that as an accepted culture yet until we, uh, you know, take in some more stuff. Hey, that's that done. Until we get a lot... Right, with London done, I can now go take out their army. So they have their 5-1 again. And we have my 3-3. Uh, my free free. So I think we're going to take less damage in the fire. That's pretty much all. The only difference. We also doubled them, so that probably did help. Beautiful. Colonizing perfectly. They lost a lot of cannons, actually. We do, I was about to say we lost less men, more men than them, but no, no. We killed a lot of cannons and cannons. Well, they're more expensive, so I'm definitely happy to kill those. Low like crown land again. Oh, fuck it. Let's just go. Let's just go help ourselves to destroying their army. That's not all of their army. They've got other army left somewhere, but <sighs> is 
Is he going to get away? Nope. That's a shame for the English. At this point, I think we it's, uh, it's more than um, a guarantee that we've won. Yeah, we'll save up some money, then we'll get the Inquisitor again. Oh, great. There would be a bunch of English peasants in the capital. Now we're losing money. Fucking hell. Hey, France. Hey, actually, hey, Portugal. I don't want to leave the war yet. If I can get Portugal out of the, this war, like, this, this is going to go so much quicker. One more month and we'll be golden. Okay, two more, man. And now I mean one more. Ugh. Oh yeah, we declared one a great power. Who was our enemy? Hey, leave the fucking Ulster our navy alone. Okay, they did. Let's return back and then we'll kick their ass again. Oh fuck you! Of course I would be losing. Now well, you know what? What's one loan in? What's well, one goddamn loan? If we can legitimately get the Portuguese out of this war, we can do with England as we please. And that is kind of the goal, doing with England as I please. Like, that's the uh, piece I would like, because it pretty much reduces the English control of Ireland to nil. And of course, any of my Irish viewers, if I do indeed have any, would more than likely love that. Quickly do a quick repair of my fleet. Of course you can have access. Uh, they're my uh, great friends of um, France. And shit, I put my... I moved... Oh, navy colon... Uh, uh, which colony's done? Which colony's done? Um, I have no fucking clue. Um, I don't have a colonist, though, apparently. There we go. No, I do. Uh, yeah, we'll colonize up here. Like I said, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll get that top area done. Okay, the English legitimately can't have any more navies in Europe, which is great. Portuguese give up, which means England, you have been. Uh, you know what? Let's um, let's not get rid of Leinster. You know what? We'll do that. It means I get a little bit of gold out of it. I get a kickback. Um. Right. So first things first. Ulster. Those are yours. You two love me, which means we're going to get you guys vassalized. Next, our ancestors once raided the shores of Ireland, even establishing the now major city of Dublin. It is time to honor their deeds and reestablish the presence there once again. Over there, Navy, go home. Core, what is left. And... Ooh, the French are a little bit upset. It didn't say the French would be upset. Okay, you didn't say the French would be upset. Oh, no. Oh, no. That's not good. Um... Right, so we need to make both of these our vassals. Uh oh. The French may rival me. 
I am worried that they may uh, not rival me. Sorry, um, they may coalition me. Uh, I'd like Wales as my vassal more than Fomund. We'll get both, obviously, but... Yeah, the goal is to just get these guys both into our... Um... But vassalize both of them ASAP. Pay off our loan. Um, why are we losing money? Oh, right. Uh, forts. Forts as well. Forts are expensive. Global trade has appeared in Vinos. It's going to be a very tense few years um, with the whole, you know, position of be French. Oh, f you game. Ugh, fine, just pay off those bribes. It's fine. Costly thing. Well, right now, I don't really have uh, any movement on my uh, people. So that's... Uh, can't seize land from you again. That's fine. Be fine. Take you back. Uh, fine, take it. Recall. Yeah, there's, a f there's quite a few people who can join. Though they are busy with a war. This does make me want to stop being friends with them. Who else do you hate? You hate Austria. So I guess we hate Austria too. Best friends, right? No. Not fucking try, aren't you? Trade embargo, plague. Oh, fuck's sake. The game is just trying to kill my economy right now. Sure, take the gold, do what you want. Yeah, I want these two underneath me as soon as possible. Yeah, vassalizing all of them will give me. Well, it'll give me a nice start on retaking England, as well as, you know, owning all of Ireland. Unfortunately, they're both religions I don't like, so that's a shame. Uh, as soon as we can, we need to annex Ulster as well. But that's going to be a while. Yeah, I have no money. And uh, that whole corruption thing can just fuck off. Oh, wow. We're actually gaining corruption. Well, that's fine. We'll gain a little bit of corruption. Transfer trade power. You know what? We'll do steer trade from Wales. Actually, no. We'll just do transfer trade power. Holy shit. The guys take forever to go anywhere. But there we go. We're losing corruption again. I must admit, I probably should have paid more attention to whether or not France was on that. That was my first mistake. However, I'm very happy. With, like, If we look at what we got, in all fairness, I'm very happy and... It shouldn't be a problem, but at the same time, a little bit scared that, you know, we could come to blows with France and... Oh, the French are no longer at war with the English. Hello, France. You're rivaled with all the same people I'm rivaled with. Isn't that awesome? Please leave me the fuck alone. Castile, you fucking failed me, by the way. Just, just to let you know, Castile, you failed me. Like, as a friend and ally, you failed me. Hmm. Okay. They're, um... They're, they're, I'm pretty sure they're happy. Fuck knows. Um... Yes, yeah, so we'll have these guys under our control. That's an extra couple. That's just extra units in in, uh, in Europe. To try and bolster my forces. And some more money into our coffers, which... Our coffers used to look a lot nicer when I didn't get level 3 advisors and everything. Oh, well. We'll have an extra merchant soon, which is nice. That's the extra merchant. Uh, got a little bit of trade power here, so let's uh, 
transfer trade power. It should automatically do it to Ohio. If it doesn't, I will um, I will investigate. Wait, I've, 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 I'm, I should be automatically guaranteeing them, so that's fine. We'll, uh, we'll offer Wales some military access, and then we'll offer um, our good friends at Foman. You know, at this point, I don't think I need to ask them if they want it. Okay. Um, ah, so we're still colonizing it. That's fine. But we do have another colonist, so we will go here. Yeah, how is... Uh, I mean, it's doing pretty fucking good, to be fair. We are nearly high enough to become an empire. I cannot wait. Alright. So yeah, we don't need to offer you anything because you're just going to join us willingly. You will give... We'll give nothing. I'm just going to wait. I'm going to wait for both of these. I don't know why you suddenly are happy with me, but okay. Looks like we're about to get double vassals right here. Yeah, the Huron isn't happy with me anymore, which is fine. I'll just annex them. The Huron believe them. The Huron have got to believe themselves too powerful. Well, if the Huron like to believe themselves powerful, that's up to them, isn't it? There we go. Breaking even until we get these cores done. Can I turn my armies off? Turn them off, it's fine. That way we can get this fucking corruption rooted out and we, you know, actually stop having to, you know, pay for it. Okay, I'm much happier with my conquest now that I've uh, got them vassalized. Uh, looks like the uh, they, the uh, my good friends, the uh, French, who definitely don't want to kill me. Um, to be fair, if we stopped being fucking friends with Castile, they probably actually wouldn't mind me. It's just, I don't want to trade up an alliance unless it's a guaranteed trade. Uh, Totemists where? I do not know why the Totemists want to rebel, but if just they just of course they fucking do, you know? Not rebelling would be too e easy, uh, too hard. Oh wow, you fucking already called and stated that. Beautiful. So yeah, I hope I apologize. Uh, apologies, guys, for like the uh, very clinical. I'm not very clinical, but like the very the uh, like the more a little bit, a little bit more attention. I would say I put towards this. Um. Yeah, I'm very happy with what we did. Very happy. The English. To say I was scared of the English for a while, I'm happy with that. I'm still scared of the Danish because of their one alliance they have. They have one alliance that's making me worried. Okay, pay for the fucking armies. Why the fuck are the Totemists wanting to rebel? Like, the fuck's in it for you guys? Elysia has 91,000. So do we, though. But they also don't have... The grand alliances that we have. Like, we have some kick ass alliances, so. The fuck have I ever done to you, Morocco? You legitimately don't want to hit my land. Why would you rival me? 
I mean, I rivaled Austria for France, but that was just, that was just like a suggestion. Like, look, France, we hate the same people. Don't hate me. Uh, okay, there we go. In Lothane, we now have got the um, got this. So, uh, taunts true faith, some missionary strength, and all that beautiful stuff. So, converting this is going to be a little bit easier. Uh, it's also not going to happen for a while because of the whole was recently converted by the bullshit um, stuff. Oh yeah, England went reformed instead of Anglican. That was just a, a big a big F right there, or a big L. But unfortunately, guys, we're actually going to have to end this part here. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do follow me on YouTube, leave a like, leave a comment, leave a share. But most importantly, guys, please do check out all of the mods down below. Have a great day. See you guys next one. See you guys then.